In this little uh, video clip, I'd like to take a look at Planner, uh, which of course is part of, uh, of Office or Microsoft 365, and how you can use this across Teams, across uh, in the web as well, and even on your mobile. Now, Planner is such a great little app to use to uh, assign tasks to people and to just manage uh, resources and things that's happening in your team in general. Now, my Planner is already added in, um, in this uh, resources um, team of mine, because of course, you can add planner as a tab in your team. If uh, if we look at the web while that's busy loading, if I look at the um, at the web and where to access planner, you'll see that planner sits here. If you don't see it there, just click on Explore All Apps. When you open planner, the hub for planner in the web, you'll uh, you'll see that you'll see all your teams there, well, all your plans that might have been created through your teams or in other places. And, uh, and of course, if you go to any of these, you can then open up the plan, see all the buckets that's been um, assigned or created in this plan and see any um, tasks as well. At the top there, you'll see boards, charts, and, uh, and a very cool thing that they brought in as well, which is schedule, which allows us to look at our tasks across um, a month period or a calendar month. So a very, very cool thing is to be able to do that. And here you can see the planner in Teams. Quite a new addition was uh, the ability now to see charts and schedule right here in your Microsoft Teams as well. That's, uh, that's pretty cool, right? So if I wanted to add a task, it's very, very simple. Firstly, is uh, just look at the buckets at the top. It's normally created with a um, to-do or a general one by default. And um, <clears throat> you can then create your own buckets from there. You can group things by buckets, but also tasks also has, um, so let's just uh, put a test task in. I just want to show you what uh, um, the labels look like. So you can also assign labels across your plans to do further categorization, if I can call it that. On the plan, of course, um, I can also put due dates on it. I can put descriptions in. I can add checklists. So do this uh, first, then do this. Oops, spelling is apparently important and um, then this, which means that you can tick specific things off as you, uh, as you get to it. You can add attachments and you can also add comments. And the comments is very important for me to stay up to date with what's happening um, in my projects. Of course, you can also assign this to someone so I can very easily there go and assign it to my faithful internship bra. And uh, where's the save button? Nope, no more save button. I'll just click and then of course it's created. Now, let me show you how cool this is on the mobile app as well. Well, there you see me projecting um, my mobile phone on here. This is uh, Android, but uh, I've used it beautifully on my iPhone as well. And, uh, and if I select uh, my little productivity stack down there and I go to Planner, I can then very easily see all the plans that I belong to or own, etc. When I click through to a specific plan, you'll see that that's the same as this one. And look there, it's... Um, definitely updates and uh, we'll add those as uh, as we go on so let's just have a look at the other buckets that's there so there you can see there's the buckets and you'll also see that it's very very simple for me to very quickly on my phone if i'm thinking about it just add another task and say hey trace um <laughs> what will this be and then um <laughs> that's funny here we go. Sorry for uh, for losing you there. Let's just go back into that. There you can see the task that I've created, and uh, which means I can go into the task here. I can change the status as well and say, hey, this is completed. But um, nice thing is I, so I can also add uh, um, comments. So let's say it's still in progress, and I can say um, need budget. Um, so we've just uh, postponed this task for a little bit, which means I can also add little um, comments on the tasks right there on my cell phone. What a great way um, to use Planner and to manage uh, the everyday things that needs to happen in your teams.